students, welcome to the math session. Today we discuss about numbers. First of all, what is numbers? Numbers is a nothing but it is a mathematical object which is used for measure, counting and label. For example, we are using phone numbers, passwords, counting the money, counting people. So all this depends upon the numbers. So generally numbers are divided by two types. So what are the first one is even number and another one is all numbers. First one is even number. Even numbers. So even numbers. Numbers ending with 0, 2, 4, 6 and 8. So these numbers are called even numbers. For example, 12, 26, 48, 54. So these numbers ending with 2, 6, 4, like that coming with, that is a even numbers. The next one is all numbers. All numbers. So all numbers ending with 1, 3, 5, 7 and 9. So which numbers are ending with 1, 3, 5, 7 and 9? That numbers are called odd numbers. For example, 41, 57, 59, 75. So these numbers are called odd numbers. Okay children, now know, let us know about the predecessor and the successor. So what is predecessor? Predecessor. So predecessor means numbers which the number that is just before the number that is called predecessor. So let example 12. So what is the predecessor of 12? So 12 that number just before the number is called predecessor. So 12 before number is 11. So 11 is the predecessor of 12. The next for example 43. So what is the predecessor of 43? Just before number. 43 before 42. So 42 is the predecessor of 43. The next. 55. So what is the predecessor of 55? Just before number. 54. So 54 is the predecessor of 55. So next. So what is successor? Successor. So success is a number that comes just after the number is called successor. For example, 15. So what is the successor of 15? So just after the number. 15 after is 16. So 16 is the successor of 15. The next. Next example, 77. What is the successor of 77? 78. Just after number. So what is successor? A number that that is just after the number is called successor. For example, 103. What is the successor of 103? So 103 after 104. So 104 is the successor of 103. Okay, so now let, let us move place value. So what is the place value? Each digit in a number has its own position, has own value in the position. For example, so place value of so you are given 23. So what is the place value of 2? So first generally we discuss about the place value. You want to know about the place value chart. So first one is 1s, 10s, 100s. Usually you want to tell about first right to left. 1s, 10s, 100s. So first one is 1s, 10s, 100s. So what is the place value of 2? So you want to first write 1s. Tens. So how many tens are here? Two. So what's the place value of two is? Two tens. Now next. Fifty-eight. So what is the place value of eight? So first you want to write ones and tens. So how many ones are here? Eight ones. So why next example? One hundred and twenty-eight. So what is the place value of 1? First you want to start 1's, 10's and 100's. So what is the place value of 1? One? 100's. 
100. The next example, 549. So write the place value of 5. So you start from 1s, 10s, 100s. So want to find place value of 5. So what is the place value of 5? 5, 5 100s. So then you want to start from 1s, 10s and 100s. So the next step, 780. So what is the place value of A? So first is 1s, 10s, 100s. So place value of 8? 8, 10s. Okay students, in next class we will discuss about the addition and subtraction. Thank you.